Hello, hello! How is everyone doing? Oops, I need to turn my tablet on so I can read comments. Can you all hear me? How is the music? Is it too loud? Let me know and I can turn it down. Um, let's see. There we go. I have chat on my tablet. How is the sound balance? Should I, should I turn music down a little bit? Fingers crossed that this music won't get copyright strike this time. It's a, uh, it should be fine. We'll see. Um, a little too loud. Okay, I can turn it down a little bit. How's that? We'll have it as like ambient background noise. Um, yeah. Hold on, I'm gonna touch my microphone, adjust it a little bit. Okay. So, today we're gonna do a D-stash. I do wanna play a little bit of Little Witch in the Woods later. We'll see how I feel. I have my box of Pop Mart here. It's kinda hard to see because you're you're looking at this from the top-down angle, but this is a, oh, you can't even tell. This is a pretty big container. So, I mean, you guys know I've been collecting toys forever. Um, I do unboxings, I hoard them, I like gotchas, and it's a way of life for me, but in December, I went to Singapore and I saw, I went to my first Pop Mart store, I guess I should say, and saw them all in person and that kind of um, triggered a new obsession. So I, not all of them, but most of them I have accumulated since like mid-December. So we're going to go through them because obviously the containers fall. I still have a row of Disney figures that I opened in my last video. And a few others that I filmed that you guys haven't seen yet that will not be featured today. But obviously I'm keeping all my Disney ones. So. <laughs> I don't, I think the plan is obviously we're going to have a keep pile. And we're going to have a de-stash pile. I think it's just going to be those two. Maybe a think about it pile where I'll hold on to them and see if like after a month or two, if I use them on my toy shelf or if I um, feel any connection to them. But... Yeah, let's start with this one. I do have a box of Tokidoki stuff here. I realized I have quite a few doubles, just like on top of the box. So I haven't looked through my collection in a while and I'm slowly thinking about like good ways to display them. So anyway, how are you all doing? Are you guys upside down? Where's my hand? You are upside down. Let me flip you guys around. Thank you for noticing. Um, let's see, I think I can do this here. Transform. Oh no, I can't. Oh, it's because it's locked. OBS is so confusing. Transform. Rotate 180 degrees. How's that? Oh, there we go. Transition. Is that better? Should be better. Hmm. Yeah, I found a box of figures up in my toy room and like some older Pop Marts were in it So I grabbed them out and put them in the container. That's why they're on the top But Yeah Ooh, a reimagined pile would be fun. So Sylvia actually makes little cute terrariums with figures. So um, She is the reimagined pile <laughs> Um, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with the D-Stash pile. Ideally, I wouldn't mind selling them and making sure they go to good homes, but with shipping, what it is right now, I'm not, I'm not 100% sure how that'll work. I will look into it. Um, I'm not against it. I'm not against trading either. So if any of you are interested in buying or trading, it will all happen on my Discord. <laughs> Sylvia pile. Okay, so let me let me make myself a little bit smaller here because I am kind of in the way. Here, I'll go down in the corner as usual. There we go. And yeah, I this is just dive in. The dogs are kind of active today, so sorry if they're a little bit rowdy or noisy, but dogs will be dogs. Okay, so Pop Mart bin. Let's dive in. But yeah, let me know in chat how you guys are doing today and where you're tuning in from, what time it is. I always love seeing the different time zones. It's so crazy, but okay. Also, um, I do want to do some cleaning because, okay, this is 
I, I will say it straight off. This is not the best way to store your figures, especially collectible figures like this, because they will rub up against each other and get paint smudges and stuff on them. Um, don't store them like this. Um, take good care of them. Get nice display cases for them. And that's what I want to do, so... Do I just grab them off the top? I don't even know how to go about this. We don't have a, a, a popper cam today. My office is such a mess right now because I've been reorganizing and stuff and trying to pull out all my journaling supplies. But yes, we will have a popper cam soon, I promise. Okay, I love Pop Mart too. Okay. Well, obviously I'm keeping all my Disney figures, so let's let's get the easy ones done with. This is Donald and Daisy from a old set. I don't know what year, but I guess I'll put keeps on the right here and we'll put the stash on the left and you guys can see him at the end. But for the most part, I'm going to keep Disney. I mean, this is a cute pair, Anna and Kristoff. We'll keep Ariel. We might look through the Disney pile later because I do have a lot of Ariels and Rapunzels, but I also don't really have a reason to de-stash them yet. So Disney's will be keepers for now. One day I'll visit Japan and I'll go to a Sanrio store. You will love it. Sanrio stores are amazing. I am worried. I'm going to go through this whole bucket. I'm going to want to keep them all. Okay, here's Dimu. Um, I think I'm going to have a maybe pile, actually. I love this Dimu. I love Dimu, the character, but um, I don't know how strict I'm going to have to be with myself. Excuse the dogs. Um... <laughs> But at some point, I feel like I'm going to have to pick an IP that I want to collect, you know? And I have so many friends that like Dimu, so he's an easy one to send off to a new home. So this one, oh, do I make a maybe pile now? You guys are going to need to help me out. I'm so indecisive. This is, this is going to be entertaining for you all. Here's another Dimu. He's a cutie. He's staying, for sure. Let's see. Azura. I love her. But again, she's not like top IP. So where do I draw the line? Right? We can go through maybes later. Okay, Azura will be a maybe. Demu's like on the close to stay side. I love these. Sylvia helped me get these. These were This was before I was into Pop Mart. I happened to see them online. I was like, hey, can you help me get these? They're adorable. And so these are staying. They're cute for a summer shelf. Um, Kenneth is staying. This is a, this is my friendship, Kenneth. <laughs> Kenneth and Yoki's are staying. Here's a cute Hello Kitty. This is also from Sylvia. This is old school Pop Mart. See, it's on the bottom here. Um, this will stay with my Sanrio stuff. Look at her head spin, though. Is it supposed to be this loose? <laughs> Um, I may need to go get a box to put the D-stash pile in because my desk is going to fill up quick. Um, Yuki's going to go in maybe. I like my Yuki's, but I don't feel the need to collect a bunch of them. And again, I have friends that love Yuki, so easy D-stash. But I do want to keep like my favorite one because I would like to have like one of each IP. <laughs> Friendship, Kenneth. Exactly. I do have an Etsy. It's I think it's closed right now. I do. I did sell my handmade resin charms there. I would like to get back to that. But yeah, it's closed right now. I think it's just Florian's craft box. Uh, what do I grab? Okay. Hapiko is staying. I love this artist. It's so cute. I also love the gradient hair. Okay, My Little Pony is a hard one for me. They're going to stay for now because it's a full set and I think My Little Pony is adorable, but part of me does feel like I have moved on from this phase, but also Pop Mart sent me these, so I want I want to keep them. It's very special to me. The first time Pop Mart acknowledged me. <laughs> so they're going to go in like a full set pile in the back here. Would be nice to display them for a while. I also found a big, not this big, but a bucket of mystery minis. Do you guys remember those? And there's a bunch of My Little Pony in there. So maybe we'll have to do like a, a farewell My Little Pony display. <laughs> uh, Pete is not staying. Where do you guys see Pete? Pete is going bye-bye. Sorry. I know you're Disney, but you're out of here. 
Um, okay, Skull Panda is the same as Yuki. I'm not. She's not like my top five IP. I would say, but there are designs that I do like. I actually have a set of Skull Panda that I need to open that I got as like an extra when I ordered through Pop Mart. But for now, we'll put Skull Pandas in the maybe pile, I guess, because I want to look through them and decide which ones I want. Okay, My Little Pony. Hmm, I used to give my My Little Pony mystery minis to my sister-in-law's nephew. He loved them. <laughs> they're cute. There's no doubt that they're adorable. I wouldn't mind keeping like I wouldn't mind keeping like just Fluttershy or just Rarity, you know, and like narrow it down. Here is another Yuki. Another Yuki. Actually, I actually have quite a few Yukis cuz I got them in my thrifted bundle. Okay, Labubu. I like Labubu, but I like the cute Labubus and I'm not going to lie, I like Zimomo better, the one with the tail. Maybe I should just collect Zimomos. Is that a good way to collect it? But here are some Labubus. They're going to go in the maybe pile too for now. Probably D stash though. Here's another Yuki. I'm going to have to take a picture of all my Yukis together before I send them off. They are cute. He reminds me of Ditto. <laughs> he does. Okay, um, Mucky is staying. And one of you guys told me, well, actually a lot of you commented when I unboxed Mucky that if you pull up Mucky's head, Mucky has teeth. Very interesting. But um, I love Instinct Toy, and I'm going to keep Mucky. Also, my favorite color. Mucky is staying. Okay, I think this design is super cute, but it doesn't really fit in with anything I own. It's not like I have a full set, so... Oh, I do love the dog, though. No, I, this is going to go in the D-stash. The glittery one looks good. I Right? The little shakers. Actually, my microphone's right here. <laughs> Did that just deafen you all? Another Ariel. Somehow, I always get Ariels and Rapunzels, which are my favorites, so I'll take them. But... Ooh, I want to take a picture with all my Ariels. This is a good way to see what I own, too, for, like, future Instagram photos. Here's Merida. I'm keeping her. Her little brothers are in here somewhere. We'll find them. See, that's another reason. I want to, like, reorganize my stuff. Another My Little Pony. Bunny. I love Bunny. Bunny Sting. Uh, Yoki is staying, of course. Um... Is that the only Yoki I have? I have a Christmas Yoki somewhere. Yoki and Kenneth are always going to stay. Here's another Labubu. I'm not... I don't know why. I'm just not really into Christmas figures or decorations or toys. So I'm putting all my Labubus together for now, but... Potentially D-stash. Um, Christmas Yoki is staying, though. How cute. Look at the little mustache. If you want to see any of these up close, I can refocus my camera and stuff, so let me know. Um, <laughs> I don't like Christmases at all. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. I just, I like summery stuff. I say I don't like seasonal stuff. Summer's fine. I just, I just don't like winter in general. My Little Pony. My Little Pony. We'll get those all out of the way. My Little Pony. Oh, yeah, this one, Twilight Sparkle came with a broken tail, so I need to glue it back on. A little unfortunate. Christmas is a no, but Easter is a yes. I mean, there's a lot of good candy for Easter. Let's see. Oh, here's some more Yokies. This is from the Planet series? I forget. Or is there a gem series? I don't know, but I love Yoki. Need a picture with all my Yokis. Cheshire is staying. Cheshire's from the old um, Alice in Wonderland set, which I believe is discontinued. I don't see it on their website. I should have a white rabbit to go with this. Another My Little Pony. 
gemstone series. That's right. Yeah, for the most part, Disney is staying. Sweet Bean Arcade is staying. Oh, I was gonna de-stash Bobo, but Arcade and Arcade is kind of cute. Uh, also, this is my only Bobo and Coco, so maybe I hold on to it for now if I'm sticking to my one of each IP. It is cute, huh? I'll put it, like, closer to my maybe pile. We'll come back to it. The weather in Japan today is very cold. Um, my computer says it is minus six degrees, and that's in Celsius. Hi, Ice Latte! How you doing? Easter is all pastel eggs and bunnies. Well, I also love spring. Another My Little Pony. So that's another reason. Here's the tray for... Actually, this is a tray for Cheshire, I think. And the other tray I pulled out was for White Rabbit. Um, Hapiko is staying. Another Labubu, but this is like purple Labubu. We'll look at all the Labubus in a second. First, we just need to go through this. Oh, here's White Rabbit. Isn't this one cute? I love it. Yeah, I feel like for figures, I usually go for more like the animal ones than human ones. Oh, here's the dishes around the world or something. This is Korea. It's kimchi. Um... It's cute and fun, but D-stash. So far we have three in the D-stash pile, guys. This is this is not going good. <laughs> mm, temporarily free from driving? Hello. How you doing, Silink? Cheshire had no tray? Wait, whose tray is this? Are you sure Cheshire had no tray? Because this is the Disney one. And White Rabbit connects to this one. Pretty sure this is Cheshire's tray. I think. That's how they came. Because I have the same one? Wait, what? Whose tray is this? Okay, Molly. I have mixed feelings about Molly. I know she's like one of their top IPs. But, I don't know. I think it's the duck lips. It's just not my favorite. It has a very, like, cutie baby doll vibe. I'm going to put all my mollies together, too, because I do have a few. And maybe we'll pick and choose. Like, save the turtles, Molly. Kind of cute. Different Cheshire. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Animal ones have much less chance of being enough in the uncanny valley where you feel they're watching you. Doing errands. Okay, drive safe. I find QP dolls a little bit creepy. Yeah, they're not my favorite. Pucky, on the other hand, though. Usually pretty cute. Though, I would choose Sweet Bean over Pucky. You know what? We need to do a Pop Mart tier list. Wouldn't that be fun? Uh, this Pucky is going in like the close to maybe pile. Um, not gonna lie, Crybaby is going. I don't know if anyone's gonna want Crybaby, but uh, I'm not a fan. Okay, these Minikos, right? I got a bunch of these in my Fifted bundle, and they're cute, but I'm not in love. I think it's the they look like babies again thing again. They're, I think they're like little, little piggies. Well, they have little pig noses, pig snouts. I'm going to look at them. We'll put them all together. I'll look at them and maybe I'll keep one. <laughs> hey, Dream Note Princess. We're just de-stashing right now. We're emptying out the bin first. And then we're going to hold them in our hands and ask if they spark joy. Here is Bunny. Um, This is a maybe for me. Um, I... I have no connection to this candy. What was it? The... I forget what they are already. See? So, um, this will be in the maybe pile. This one is Zimomo. Oh no, I lost a bird. It's in here. We'll find it. Um, I do like Zimomo. Zimomo has a tail, so I will be keeping this one. 
put it back here. They will become more a uh, cry more baby when Heavy D stashes them. It's not a candied apple. It's um um a berry, but I forget what it's called. Haw? Is that right? I think. The bunny one on the bottom is adorable. Hold on, let me refocus my camera too. It was focused on the top of the container. Now we're getting down to the bottom. This one? The Minico? This one's actually flocked. It's pretty cute. I'm putting all my Minicos together. We'll take another look at them. Here's another Minico. Um, Molly? I don't think the artist is Japanese. These are all from Pop Mart. Um, I'm not sure. This is Molly. Fishing friend Molly. Sardine can Molly. And I have to make sure I have all the parts too. So this all goes together. Molly is by a Hong Kong artist? Okay. I was pretty sure. <laughs> it's ha, don't quote me on the spelling. I've had the ha flakes. They're they're yummy. It's just I don't I didn't really grow up eating them. It is a random shooting star. This goes with this Yoki, I believe. This does not go with this Yoki. I forget what this goes with. We'll figure it out in a second. I forgot I had this Yoki. See, we need to de-stash. Um, this Yoki has a stand. We'll find it. I am running out of room. Okay, I need to stand up here because I can't see into the container. <laughs> okay, all the heat on those are staying. That There's no questioning that. Aren't they cute? So we'll put them back here. Love my hero nose. Ah! Oh no, I dropped a small piece. Who does that go to? Oh, it's a little net. I see it. Oh no, Sammy's going for it. I'll be right back. I'm gonna go grab it. Sammy? I am back. Here is the net for Dimu. And... Okay, another Miniko. Yeah, if we're gonna be D stash headphones, I know. Um Crybaby's going out. What was I saying? If we're gonna downsize, I think the mini cos are gonna have to go. There's a Molly. This one's cute. I don't know. This one I kinda like. This might be the Molly that I keep. I like the black hair, I think. It is a Michael Jackson Daku. And I'm not obsessed with it. The music festival series, just, I don't know. It's not bad. There's no one in there that I'm really like, oh, I need. The EDM one's cute, but that's about it. I forget how this goes on the stand. There, but I think it turns a little more. I forget, where does he go? Oh, no, he holds the microphone. There we go. Goes like this. Yeah, I'm not obsessed with this Daku. I do like Daku, but... This potential D stash. Um, I don't even know what this is from. It does say Pop Mart. It says Flapjacks. Yeah, I, I don't know. You like the Daku? I mean, I love Daku as a character, but that design and like that that series, yeah. Here is another Dimu. I got this in a whoops um, bundle. He, his um, Pop Mart logo scratched off, but he's cute. He's like a I don't know what he is like a jellyfish. Another Yoki, Christmas Yoki. Around the world Yoki. This is London. And uh, this set's okay. There, it's not my favorite favorite. I'm gonna keep Yoki in here because we're gonna put some stuff back because I'm running out of space. This Yoki's adorable. Yeah, let's get this over. I'll keep the keep for sure ones in here. Another La Boo Boo. This one comes with a tricycle. It's okay. It's cute, but I don't know. I I like La Boo Boo. But not all the designs, I feel like. 
My plane heat on those missing propellers? What? Which ones? Are there more? These are from the La Boo Boo series 2. I, eh. D stash. Oh, Applejack. Here I am with the. Ah, uh, My Little Ponies. Here's a Pucky, which goes with this. But I think it goes with this, but I don't know how it goes with this. Like, there's does it just sit on it? I'm not sure. I actually don't know. Because this was another um, thrifted one. This is going to go in the maybe pile. Chip. And Dale from two different sets. This Dale was a thrifted one. I don't know what he was holding. I think it was like a twig. It was not in the box. So he's missing a piece. But I'll put them with the Disney ones for now. And then here's a Skull Panda. Meh. Meh. I'll go in the potentially D stash. Um, I need to remember which one this goes with. I think it's a Yoki. Yeah, it's a Yoki. But, oh, it's a stand. I thought it was a cape for some reason. It's this one. I believe. That looks right. And then, sweet bean. I think I'll probably keep. My friend did say that they wanted this one specifically when they bought the blind box, so I may pass it on to them. We'll think about it. Will I be generous or not? Oh, and a random doll sock. That does not belong in here. <laughs> this from Mercury? Okay, good. I'm glad I got it right. Oh my goodness, your set looked so good. Oh no, tiny, tiny piece. Who does this belong to? Oh, this is Mucky's nose. Yeah, the thing about Pop Mart is that it comes with tiny pieces, so if you're not displaying it, you have to make sure you keep everything together. Okay, and here's like the little pieces that go with like mini glow. Um, this one's Skull Panda. Um, we'll I'll figure these out later. Mainly mini go and Molly, I think. And then the Crybabies. So, the Yogi's are too cute. I am putting the Yokies back in because they are all stay. Maybe I'll post some Yoki photos on Instagram later on if you guys want a closer look. Oh, they're so cute. That stand does not want to stay on. Stay there, Yoki. Kenneth is staying, of course. I want more Kenneth figures. Um, let's see. Donald and Daisy are 100% staying. Mucky staying. Happy goes staying. You guys can tell who my favorite IPs are. Hirono is staying. I don't know. I love Demu. The design's cute, but I think I would choose Hirono over Demu. That being said, this Demu is staying. Um, Anna and Kristoff are staying. Okay. Here's where we need to decide. Am I a... Am I a Little Mermaid collector? Honestly, they're all very different. I don't see a reason to be like, let's just keep one Ariel. I think I want them all. They're staying. I have a Rapunzel. She's just cute. She's staying. Merida is staying. Oh, her brothers are in the little plastic thingy. Um, Cheshire and White Rabbit are staying. Yeah, I think all well, my Disney ones are staying. And then my summer Sanrio ones from Sylvia are staying. And this Hello Kitty is staying. Um, these two, I'm not too... I don't really care. I'm sorry, I forgot. I was in focus up here. This one's missing a piece, so it is kind of hard to sell or trade. This one goes with the Donald and Daisy, so eh. I'm gonna put it back in the maybe pile. We'll think on it. 
This is almost staying. I do need to find the bird, though. I thought it would be at the bottom of the bucket. But I know it's here somewhere. So that's staying. Oh yeah, and bunny staying. I love this bunny. How what do we how do I feel about this demu? I like the design. Am I going to collect demu? Uh not sure. But I'll hold on to it for now. The My Little Ponies are going back in for now because I still would like to take cute photos with them and I like having the full set so for now they're staying okay now it's our now we're making real decisions let me sit down again yes yeah yep, let me put a lid on the container so the dogs don't get into it no touchy okay <laughs> Oh, you saw the missing bird? Wait, where was it? See, you guys catch things. <laughs> it was, oh, was it in the container? Okay, okay. Good. Thank you. <laughs> okay, we get it. You saw it. Okay. So, for now, this is the D stash. 100% D stash. Because unfortunately, when opening blind boxes, you are going to get one, so you just don't care for. So these are bye-bye ones. This goes with this. And obviously, I don't mean to offend any of the artists. They're all very talented. I think Azira's going to stay for now. I, I like her. She's cute. Um, Here, let me... Let me push back everything in the maybe pile, and we'll we'll think about them. Not everyone enjoys the same art. Exactly! And if they can go to a better home where someone will appreciate them, that's so much better, I feel like. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with them. It's just, you know, a preference. Okay, this is the maybe pile. Did we say bye-bye to Chip? Chip and Dale? Okay, Chip and Dale, go bye-bye. We, we have to draw the line somewhere, especially with Disney stuff, since there's so many that I like. This bunny, I'm just not attached to, so I'm going to say bye-bye. Let's look through the Yukis. I want to keep one, and I'm thinking it's this one, because I really like that one. The silver one's pretty. Do I like the shaker ones? Do they bring me joy? Me. What do you guys think? I think I'm gonna keep that Yuki and de-stash the rest. Thinking time. Can get nicer Chippendale next time? Yeah. Bashing, making fun of people's preferences isn't good. Definitely not. We have to, we should totally understand that everyone likes different things. And that's, that's great. <laughs> okay. It's not that the figures aren't cute. It's that they don't suit your fancy. Exactly. That's the perfect way to word it. Okay, so this Yuki's staying. And the rest are going bye-bye. Also, I don't know if it's because they're older or if the person had them on display. Because these are thrifted Yuki's. They... <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, the plastic is a little cloudy, but one of the figures that I got fresh out of the box was like this too, so it could just be the plastic. Okay, um, yeah, I'm not in love with Michael Jackson Daku. I feel like he could definitely have a better home. So. Oh, well, he could have a better home if I didn't break him. <laughs> it didn't snap though, it just came off, so... I will go find that piece. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe he won't have a better home. Oh, I see it. It's it's not broken. It just came off. <sighs> Let me go grab it before the dogs get it. <laughs> uh, that sound was Sammy falling over. <laughs> 
chaotic here today. Uh, here, just to show that it did not break, though I did get some paint on the stand. Um, there, all better. So he's going to stash. I'm not going to try to put that on the stand again. <laughs> it got abbeyized. Um, okay, let's look at, okay, the Minikos, they're cute. I, I don't dislike them, but uh, this is not my thing. Unfortunately, a lot of these are the thrifted ones, but it was a good deal, and I got a few that I really like out of them, so it's still worth it. <sighs> what else? Do I see any other Minikos? I don't think so. The white blob with the coins is Bobo and Coco. This set's really cute. They have some cute designs. I think I will keep this because it is my one and only Bobo and Coco. And I do like the arcade vibe. So we're going to keep the sweet bean too. Plus this is like one of my favorites out of this set. They had a gacha, crane game, and arcade game. So I would like to collect those. Um, Skull Panda. This one's cute. Like, if I were picking between the two, I would choose to keep this one. But there are other Skull Pandas out there that I like. So, hmm. Well, this one's D-Stash. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep thinking about this one. Molly... Molly, Molly, Molly. I think Molly's gonna go bye-bye. I, uh, I just don't see myself collecting Molly. She has some cute designs, for sure. The, like, art is adorable. So for my one Molly, maybe I'll keep this one because I do feel some attachment to this design. And it is summery. So, keeping one Molly. My one IP rule. Anything for Sylvia to reimagine? Well, um, I will... She she can get first dibs from the D-stash pile. <laughs> and then we'll see from there. Maybe trade for a different design. I, I'm, I'm gonna reimagine some. We'll see. Who made the Daku one? Um, Daku... Who's the artist for Daku, actually? It just says Daku. Okay, the Laboobus. Again, I have my Zimomo that I'm happy with. I'm not super attached to any of these designs. It's not that I don't... I don't... It's not that I dislike Laboobu. I love Laboobu, actually. But... Eh, like, purple Laboobu, maybe I keep. But the others, I'm kind of whatever about. This will be my maybe pile. This one, I'm okay with passing this sweet bean on to my friend. It's cute. But if my friend was wanting it, I think it would look cute on their shelf. So, well, this is this is two friends, so it's not a D-stash pile, I guess. <laughs> Deku is Korean artist. Hi, cool. How you doing? We're doing some D-stashing. Okay, now we're down to the hard ones. Pucky. The tea party? D uh, ducky. Pucky is kind of cute. I do have some other puckies that I haven't shown on camera video yet that I actually haven't really taken a close look at myself, but it's the Disney and Pucky collab, so I will be keeping those. I'm not, I'm not super in love with this one. I don't really know how it's supposed to be displayed either. Am I, is this, oh, it's upside down, I bet. That's supposed to be like this. It's cute, but kind of thing, you know? I'll keep this one for now. This will be my one pucky until I open the other ones. Oh, pink salt duck who's still in his box. I have him here, but I am i don't want to take him out. Okay, here is the hard question. These could potentially be Sylvia Reimagine ones, but also I feel like if Sylvia got her hands on these, she would just keep them. 
Because <laughs> Sylvia's a big Dimmu fan. They're cute. There is no doubt that these designs are adorable. I'm just unsure if I want to collect Dimmu figures. Because you guys saw, I kept Yogi, Hirono, some Sanrio ones, and my Disney ones. How do I feel about Dimmu? <laughs> the clear one's so cool. I do love the design of the clear one. Okay, I think you're right. I think you're right. And maybe then we pass this one on. Because we are trying to make more space. Ugh. It hurts my soul to de-stash a Dimmu, though. But he will have a better home. Okay, Skull Panda. I feel like... I will come across a better design in the future. She's cute. She comes with um, some bread and sandwiches too, so I'll find them and put them together. Mm, yeah, she's cute, but there are better ones. Better ones out there for me. And Labubu. I feel like I feel the same way about this Labubu. I have my cute peach Zimomo. Here, let's refocus for you guys. So, I feel like as we open more blind boxes, I will meet the perfect La Boo Boo. <laughs> Pop Mart dating. Keep the clear one, send the other to Sylph. Okay, so this will go in the Sylph pile. Oh, well, not Sylph pile, but friend D-stash. I think I, think I D-stashed a good chunk, right? I don't know if I would say half, but there's room in my container again. Demon. Demon is the perfect boy. <laughs> um but yeah, if you're interested in any any of these, um join on Discord. Did the stream just die? Dimmo. Sylvia, you're struggling. The stream didn't die, right? I have like a circle of death on my screen. Demon demo. <laughs> it's live. Okay, phew. Thank you, thank you. Sorry. I was panicking for a second. So, out of my maybe pile, I'm keeping these guys. Whoop. And I think you guys see a color scheme. You guys can tell what I like. This one is like the one IP for Coco and Bobo. My one Molly. My current one Pucky. And we just love this design. The rest will go to new homes. Um, like I said, I'm not against trading or selling. Um, shipping from Japan will be insane. I will say that right now. Um, I am willing to let them go f for you know a fairly cheap price, or whatever trade or something. So if you're interested, like if you're serious about adding these to your collection, join my Discord. I'll maybe make a trading channel or something, or we'll figure it out. But Yes, um, I have all the little pieces that go with these. The only one that's missing something is Dale. He came like this, so I can't do anything about that. But yeah. Oh, actually, the Yukis are going to Sylvia, too, so sorry. Unless she doesn't want any of them. But I also have another friend who is obsessed with Yuki, so they get first dibs. But otherwise. Yep. <laughs> yep. Hold on, I have a box here. I'm going to put them in the box. And then I guess maybe we'll look through my Tokidoki stuff? <laughs> Shaker Yuki? Oh, Rokoko, you can take it up with Sylvia then. <laughs> Fight amongst yourselves, children. Okay, let me put these in the box. And let's, let's chat a bit. How is your weekend going, guys? Are you having a good time? What is this one? Oh, this goes with Labubu. His scepter. I'm gonna keep the little pieces out of the box, so I'll put them together. I'm seeing more Daku designs and love it. Daku is adorable. There's a food series that's not out anymore. Well, it's still on their website, so I'm like, I'm hoping that they restock it. I don't know what they do when they discontinue stuff, if they remove it completely or what, but, um,. The food series. I really love it, and I want that if it comes out. There's a sports one? I hope Deku gets a new set this year. That would be really cool. 
<laughs> Sell me what some of the fantasy four selves I ordered on accident. Wait, you ordered some on accident? What happened? Oop. Spin class killed me? Ooh. I've heard that spin classes can be hard. Okay, let me put this down here. For those of you that missed it, oh, I almost dropped it. Let me fix this. Here is my keep bin. This was full though, so don't judge me too hard. Obviously, I'm buying Pop Mart because I like them, so not all of them are going to get destashed. But um, here are the ones that are staying. I'm happy with what we achieved today, though. What we accomplished. Now I can go buy more to open. <laughs> okay, let's put this one down. Pop Mart destashing done. Okay, next is Toki Doki. <laughs> do you stash that cloth? No, I've had it forever. It's pretty. I do need more cloths though because, um, yeah, this one's getting kind of boring. Judging just a little bit. No. Okay, so this one's just in a cardboard box. This was up in my toy room waiting to be sorted out. Um, yeah, I'm not ashamed of my hoarding habits, and also there's dog hair on it. These could be a little dusty. They were just sitting up there for a long time. So, um, maybe we might have to do, like, a figure cleaning live stream. But, um, <laughs> I don't know when or how this happened, but apparently I have three of these guys. I'm just gonna pull everything out, actually, and then we'll look through it. I would like to keep all my unicornos. And last time I went through my collection, I didn't destash anything. I was like, Tokidoki, I'm keeping. But today, today we make it happen. Like, some are still in their bags. Like, I think I received some of these in Happy Mail. Have a playlist with your videos from this channel and crafting channel? Oh, thank you. Used to sell Tokidoki. Really? Interesting. I do have a lot of early series. I think. I don't remember. But they are dusty. They need to be cleaned. Oh my goodness. This box is like Mary Poppins' bag. <laughs> what other stuff are you planning? Well, I have... I don't know what we'll go through today, but... Um, I'm gonna go through my gotcha stuff for sure. And my mystery minis. My mystery minis are cute, but it may be time to say goodbye. I don't know if anyone is interested in them anymore. That was like my start with blind boxes. You guys would send so many of them to me. They're adorable. But it is the thought that we appreciate. And it's okay to let things go. This is definitely not a Tokidoki. This looks like a Pokemon, but I don't know what it goes to, so... Ooh, this box is dusty. Oh my goodness. This is bad. Here, video thumbnail. Are these... These might be from... I don't even remember. I feel bad. I think these are from Polymomo T. I feel like. We're the only, we're, he's the only person I really trade figures with. Unless it was a gift, but I haven't had a P.O. box in a long time, so. Oh, I thought that was yellowing for a second. I think that's just the color it is. Thumbnail! De-stashing my Tokidoki collection! Oh, uh, Evan, it was making me anxious pulling it out of the box. <laughs> Night, Lazzy! Sleep well! <laughs> if you know any kids that like unicorns, true, true. Mufia, Mufia is adorable. Okay, shall we play I Spy? Let's pull out all the Mufia first. This is not Mufia. This is Breakfast Buddies. Mufia. I do love Mufia. Here's a Mufia Togi Dogi. I 
think I would like to keep my Mufias. Ooh, they are. I think the plastic is aging a little bit. I need to take better care of them. Ah! Is this a Mufia? I mean, it's it's the food one, right? Green tea. Actually, that may be it for my Mufias. I thought I had more. Okay, well, I am keeping these because I like those. I guess they'll just go back in the same dusty box for now. It was never ending. It's chaos. Oh. <laughs> the cow print bottle is one. Do we see a cow print bottle or did I already grab it? Okay, the next one are the sushi cars. These were fun to open. I'm not obsessed with them like the way I am with Tokidoki. I think... I guess I only have four. I have like a little sushi car. I don't know what that's from. You guys have a better view than me because you have the top down view. Oh, I see it. Got it. <sighs> sushi cars are a maybe. I, when I see things in a set, I want to keep them. Oh, look, I have another sushi car here too. But it's a double. Oh, these might be from Linda, actually. I think she sent me some Tokidokis. But, um, yeah. Strawberry milk one on a unicorn. This is going to go with the unicorn nose, though. Do I have? Okay. Oh, look it. I have one with and one without. That's cool. Okay, sushi cars. Doubles definitely go, so we'll put the bagged one. In the D stash pile, which is going to start up here, I guess. Um, this was, a, I think, a blind box. I'm not into Marvel. I like, I like the movies, but I didn't grow up with the comics and stuff like that, so I have no attachment. Also, I have no attachment to Red Skull. So, bye-bye. <laughs> uh, um, put the food ones with Mufia. Okay, yeah. Good idea. So these are staying. The green tea... Mm. I'm I'll put in a maybe. I'm not super in love with it. <coughs> Excuse me. Actually, you know what? Let's hydrate, guys. I could use a sip of my juice box. Everyone have some water, please? <laughs> I muted my microphone, but I could see my PNG tuber moving. Sippy sip! Everyone sip! Oh, did the music stop? It did, didn't it? Let's turn that back on. We need some calming music. The cat on my lap decided no water break for me. Oh no! Tell your cat you need to be healthy. <laughs> Tiny mermaid in a clamshell phone charm. Yes, it is. This is cute. Miss Tiny. Um, I think I want to focus on the unicornos. I made these stash the tra straps. They're adorable, though. Yeah, I think straps go bye bye. That is cute, though. Oh, I see doubles already. We'll, we'll figure that out in a second. You know what? I don't, I'm don't. i not a fan of this green tea. Green tea's going bye-bye too. I think it's just the label. And here are the t smaller neon star ones, I think. Um, I have a few of these. Is this the one? Yeah. I think these will go bye-bye too. We want to stick with the, the normal, regular, whatever they are. Okay. Oh, I'm so overwhelmed, guys. <laughs> Here's the little sushi cars. What do- okay, so that's a double. 
I'll pull out what I can see first. And these two are doubles. I don't even know what series each one is from. Do we see any more doubles? This is like playing a matching game. Hmm. I swear I had some more doubles. Let's pull the Myrmacornos out. These need to be cleaned up. You can just take an eraser to these that have paint smudges though. Fairly easy. I do love my Myrmacornos, so they're staying. Please add one of the Sakura unicorns. Sure. <laughs> it's like you're shopping while you watch. <laughs> Myrmacorno. Ah! Okay, I'm just putting these in the box. If you guys want to see them later, I'll line them up and take a picture. But if I don't start clearing this, it's just going to get super overwhelming. Myrmacorno. I don't think any of those were doubles. Myrmacorno. That's not a Myrmacorno. I think I got them all. I, th I swear this isn't Tokidoki. This is going in the box. I don't even know what that is. Nope, Myrmacorno. Did I get them all? You guys, oh, here's another one. Wait, is this a double? It is. Okay, I think this is like Perlina or something. So one's going D-stash. Let me look at the ones in the box. These are not doubles. Oh, this, oh, this is a Myrmacorno. It's a Myrmacorno with a bear on it. Red hair unicorn doubles. Red hair unicorn doubles. You are correct. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. The doubles pile. You guys can't see it, but it's right here and it's growing. Or the D-stash pile. Whatever. Wait, you're D-stash too. <laughs> this is so overwhelming. Um, I think I got all the Myrmacornos. That was a good eye. Brown in the middle with pink mane. Thank you. <laughs> this is kind of fun. Oh, is this a Myrmacorno? It is. Oh, this is the one I just got. This is seashells. Okay, Myrmicornos. Anything else? Let me look at the comments. Bottom left blue and white is series one. This one? I think it is too. I think this one. This one is series one. I think this one might be too, right? These need to be cleaned up though. And I think this one is too. I actually have a lot of series one, I think. Here, let's get these up a bit. Okay, now I'm going to pull out the non- Unicornos, Donatella, Cactus Pup, Cactus Pup. This Cactus Pup's cute. Um, Donatino, who also needs to be cleaned. Yeah, maybe we'll have like a, a Woody, like Toy Story 2 session. Figure salon. Mm, I'm not super... Worried about keeping non-unicornos. They are cute, but... If anything, I would keep the cactus pup, but... <laughs> they are cute, though. Look at them. Oh my goodness. Okay, cactus pup and donut cat. Oh, these are going to go in the maybe pile. These little ones are going to go in the D-stash. Gotta draw the line somewhere. This one's series two. Oh, the advent calendar ones, I don't even have them here. They're in a zippy. They're all together. Um, I mean, I'm not probably not going to display them. Maybe I'll do a Christmas toy shelf. Do I keep them for a year and see? Sort them by color. That's actually a good idea. <laughs> Here's all the white ones. Pink. The pinkish ones up here. Oh, I love kaiju. This one's so cute. As well, I can start pulling out the ones that I definitely like if there are no more doubles. This one's so cool. Oh, actually, I guess the ones I got from Jerry in my Happy Mail video aren't in here either. 
Good night, Paul. Can you put another Sakura unicorn in the slip pile? Yes. What about the what about this one? This would make a good terrarium, right? Peacock one, that's fancy. Well, you can decide later what you want. Um, you know what? I'm gonna de stash these guys. I have so many unicornals and I wanna open more unicorn blind boxes. Cause they're fun to open. The cactus one was an early series. Uh, the cactus pup? Yeah, this was like super, super early. This was like even before I started collecting unicornos, I think. Oh, are these? These are not doubles. Oh, look at Sylvia! It's a clown! Your favorite! Okay. For the most part, I think I'm gonna keep them all. Don't really have a reason to de-stash unless they're like worth a lot of money, but oh, doubles! You guys couldn't see because it was out of frame. No, oh, this one has like a little paint stain though. I don't know if that'll come out. It's different from a smudge. Let's look on the de-stash. There, I think you can see everything now. Some of these with the stars on them look so similar, but they're not. Oop, put your tail down. Pink, white, red and white, popcorn. Oh, doubles. <laughs> oh, you got it. Thank you, Rococo. Oh, cactus unicorno. This one? He has no guy on his back. <laughs> um, Elle is looking at her shadow and just staring at it. Oh, I wish I could show you guys. <laughs> the sun's coming in the window. Pink and white is a good combo. I think my favorite is this one, obviously, because it's purple. Like the angry ones and the goth looking ones. Is that one by the D stash of Mermicorn? No, you are correct. This one looks like a wasp. This one's kind of scary. <laughs> okay, I'm putting this one back in the box. Look at that. Teamwork. We're doing so good. I swear one of these is a double, but it's not. It just has one on its back. I keep looking at the same ones. Um... I think we got it. Right? No more doubles? This one's so pretty. I love the translucent ones. If in the future I have to de-stash anymore, maybe I'll col col collect, collect the translucent ones. Let's look at their soap. Why is this one sticky? Okay, these need to be cleaned. This one has a translucent mane. Oh, this one's trans- no, this one isn't translucent. This one's cool, it's like a Frankenstein's monster. No, they don't really make- it's- uh, the white and colored ones are the standard, I feel like. Ugh, do I de-stash even more? Part of me's like, they're all unicornos, I love them. But I do see designs in here that I would be okay with letting go of. These translucent ones are staying. We'll wash that sticky one later. I don't know why it's sticky. This one's staying. I love this one. Pink and white one with milk written on it. Okay, I think you might be seeing this. Let me know if you see something else. This one has a uh, Mufia on its back. But if you see another one, let me know. Um, like, should I make a pile of the ones I would be okay letting go? Make a large display to say goodbye. That's actually a good idea. That one looks like my PNG. Oh, the color scheme. It kind of does actually, doesn't it? The purple. I guess that's why I like this one. It's my, my color scheme. 
Make a big, make a pile, big pile. Okay, I'm gonna pull these down and I'm gonna make a pile of ones I'm okay with letting go of. I don't really care for like the gold ones. This one is, I don't know. This is like from the old, old series. Is this, is this, is this one considered? I feel like this was like even before like cultural appropriation and stuff was a thing. Is this accurate? Is this, is this one okay? It's cute, the design. I don't really like this one. I think this one's like a tie one. Yeah. I don't really like gold. I, I never really have. I don't really care for that one. This one's fancy, but it's not really my style. This one I'm keeping. This one has a translucent mane, so she's just going straight in the box. This one has a translucent mane too, so I'm keeping that. We love the translucents. Translucent sushi. Keeping. Keep them all into a final D stash so there are no regrets. True. Okay. This was from the Sakura series, I think. Actually, a lot of them are, I believe. Um, Sylvia's gonna hate me, but I actually don't really care for flocked figures. I prefer, like, a smooth, glossy plastic. Ooh, and the tail has stains, too. This one is a cute design, though. We do like cherry blossoms. This one's, like, a little too, like, fancy looking for me. Can you guys see them? Sorry. The burger one's cute. I think I like that one. We'll keep this one for sure. I don't know why I'm just holding this one. I like kaiju. I like the ones with um little characters on their backs. So I will keep all of those. This peacock one's fancy. I'll keep it. We're getting there. We're getting there. This is another flocked one. This is a cute design though. Ugh, I don't know. <laughs> the burger is cute. I love it. Okay, I like this one. These are like the OG ones. I do want to kind of keep those. I think this one, you said this was series two. I think this is an OG one too. I'll have to look at the checklist. You said the cactus one was? I like this one. It's like Harajuku kawaii style. <laughs> the goldfish one's pretty. I like that one. Eh. I'm not too big on greens either. This one with the cranes on it. I think it's supposed to be like a Japanese style. Like a geisha style. Eh. This one I'm not too crazy about either, surprisingly. I think this is an old one too, prin prin princess something. This one's cute, I like the colors. We'll keep the colorful ones. I like this one. It has a bow on its tail. The swan one is extravagant, but I like it. Okay, we're getting there. We're gonna make it. <laughs> The clown? I don't mind the colors, but eh. This one is cute. I like this one. Strawberry milk. I think this is an oldie too. You can kind of tell by the plastic. Looks like the Native American one is series three. Oh. Victoria. Yeah, oh, I don't know. It's just, I did it's not quite my style. Okay, popcorn. Popcorn I feel kind of whatever about. This one's cute. It's like a can can. I think I can't I think its name is can can. I will keep this one. This is like the Tokidoki, so I feel like I have to keep this one. How do we feel? How do we feel about the clown? I think his name was Actually, I don't remember what his name was. You said white, pink, flock. Goes in Sylvia pile. <laughs> oh, 
Sylvia's just using this stream to shop and add to her own collection. Also, um, I'm sure you guys have figured it out and know by now, but Sylvia is an IRL friend, so that's why she's getting dibs. But, um, yes. I am... I, I will post the others on Discord, and we can figure something out, maybe. Ideally, I would like to sell them as a bundle, but I, I get that not everyone's gonna like the same stuff, so we'll figure it out. <laughs> it's little... It's our collection after all. Exactly! I have to spread the joy. That just means that you and Sylvia will get along. Look at all that dust on my cloth now. Okay, this is the D-stash pile for Tokidoki, I think. Ugh. No, I, I just don't like the gold that they use. And that's okay. Doubles. Okay, now I have to decide. How, what, how do I feel about my sushi cars? Do they even still make sushi cars? Because if I were collecting them, I would keep them. But... If I'm not getting any more, I'm kind of okay with letting them go. Hmm... The pink and perp with crown says Abby. The pink with purple crown? Which one? This one? I don't know which one you mean. The sushi cars are cute. No, I do like them. Oh, this one? The pink and purple? Is that one you mean? Oh, you mean this one? It's the gold on top. I'm not a huge fan of the gold that they use. Oh, uh, I'm gonna keep the sushi cars. I feel like I will regret them if I let them go. So, but the little sushi cars can go. Okay, and then these are still in the packaging, but I will keep them because they're the newer Tokidukis with the characters on their back. I'll just leave them in the bag for now, though, so they don't get dusty. Okay, that was that was a project. We made it through, though. I mean, it's not a huge tea stash, but I did downsize a little. Considering that, most of them are unicornos. I was like, oh no, Myrmicorno, but that's a double. So I think we're good. I'm not gonna lie, I think I do have some more unicornos, like, scattered here and there in different boxes, so... It is Thai theme. There's a little elephant right there. I'm also not a fan of magenta pink. I guess this is more magenta than that one, but... I'm not the hugest fan of hot pinks, bright pinks. That's not a hot pink, but... Anyway. Hmm. Okay. Where is my D-stash bucket? I think I'll just put it in with my Pop Mart ones for now. Okay, Lion, have a good evening. Will I play World of Goo? Um, I don't know what World of Goo is. <laughs> yeah, it is. It's definitely Thai themed. Looks like a temple. Okay. You know what? I feel better. Look at this. I'm going to show you guys. Actually, let me make sure I don't dox myself because there is a label on this. But this is the D-Stash box. I think we did good. That's a whole box. It's pretty heavy too. Okay, um... I am overwhelmed by all the de-stashing that happened. So, I'm going to stop here today. I don't think I can make any more 
smart decisions and I would like to play a little bit of Little Witch in the Woods. So I'm going to switch over. I'm going to pause for like five minutes or so, go to the bathroom, get something to drink. Um, you guys do the same. Um, come hang out with me. I'm just going to chill for a little bit and see if we can get a little further in the game. And thank you so much. <laughs> like, actually, thank you guys. Because I am so indecisive. It was amazing having you guys here helping me. And looking through my Tokidokis. Because if it was just me, I would have dumped them all right back into the box. So, I appreciate you guys. I'm going to move this off so it doesn't show the address. Um, yeah, I'll be right back. Give me about five minutes or so. And we'll play some games. Hello, hello, I am back. Let's see if everything is set up properly. Let me close down my tablet. 
We're gonna continue. Do you guys remember where we left off? Um, let's see. My controller does not want to work. Let's see if I can remedy that. Oh, there we go. Continue. Blue lizards. Oh yeah, we were collecting stuff. Let's see, I did um, do a little bit of collecting, harvesting for potions and stuff, but I didn't do any of the story, so let's try to remember where we were. That was a fun D-stash, Chris. I, I enjoyed myself. It was, it was nice to look through everything I have, because I do tend to shove things into a box and forget about them. This game, I mean, it's a, it's pretty simple. It's your, um, you've just graduated from the Witch Academy, you're heading to your apprenticeship, and you get left in the woods here because you went out to adventure while the train was getting fixed or something, I don't remember. But, um, yeah, now we live in the witch's house, and we're trying to restore the town. Um, find the prickly vine core, because there is a very loud bird. And, oh, we need to get, um, a potion. Or make a potion. So let's, where do I look at the potions I can make? Keywords, gaga bird. Wait, how do I look at stuff? I remember nothing. Nope, that's not it. <laughs> no, this is to make the potions. Wait, where do I look up the potions I can make? Wasn't there a book or something I use? Oh my goodness, my brain. I didn't touch the game for like two weeks. Now I don't know how to play it. Wait, actually, where are the potions? How- <laughs> Hold on. I'm gonna refigure this out. I have a book. That shows me, reminds me how to make things. Okay, I didn't mean to drop that on the ground. Sort by newest. Okay, that puts me on my broom. What? How do I look at my potions again? Okay, this is my storage. This is other storage. My brain. What did I look at to look at the ingredients for potions? I need Silank back here. <laughs> okay, I've pushed all the buttons. I'm confused. Okay, let's let's walk around, gather some stuff. Um, I'll remember. I have a, a catalog or index somewhere. Pursuing mini so no 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 don't worry, don't worry, don't look. Drive safe. I just can't remember how to open up my index thingy. Um, but yeah, this game is cute. You can pick up things, you can pet the bunnies and get their fur. Hold on, let me turn off my other music. I just realized it was playing in the background. Don't need double music. You're in a store. Find some cute blind boxes. Oh, I should have said before everyone left, um, <laughs> when the D-Stash ended. I'm gonna have community night next week. We're gonna play games on Discord. I think we're gonna play some Gardic Phone. Maybe try to find some Jackbox games that we can all play. Um, I did find this game called Spyfall. It looks like a sim more simple version of, like, Among Us or Mafia. Okay, I want to look up the potions that I can make, but... I do not remember how. Is it in the house? Here, yeah, we can fly. Clarence is the best section. 
That's where I always beeline to. Sorry guys, we're gonna take a few minutes to refresh my memory. Keywords. I swear there was something to look at to <laughs> see how potions were made. There's a book at the bottom of the cauldron. Is this it? I mean, I opened it, but this just shows me how to, not how to, but lets me put stuff in. I think this is just where I mix stuff. Ingredients. Am I gonna have to go back and look at my own stream? This is to upgrade my broom or like keep it. Upkeep it, I guess. Um, this is the extractor thingy. What did I look at? Was it something upstairs? Aw, kitten sitting on your shoulder. Cute. This is just to save. I... I'm so confused. Where do I look at my recipes again? Here's Diane. Well, let's see what potion. Oh, you can longer deliver today. Okay, that's fine. Let's see what's in your shop. Potion sale? No, that's where I sell them. Surprisingly, there's not a lot of blind boxes. No! Which is cupcake recipe. Well, let's buy this recipe. <laughs> I think we want the earmuff potion for the gaga bird anyway. So we'll buy it. Let's buy some more chalk. There's two, so let's buy all. Twinkle twinkle juice. Sure, let's buy it. It's ten coins. Um, I don't think we need the cupcake right now. Bye, Diana. Okay, here's my inventory. I am using... Oh! It's... No, nope, it's not that button. Aha! It's the little menu button on the left. Okay, that, that took long enough. <laughs> the R button shows the little quests on the side here, what we're currently working on. Thank you for being patient with me, guys. Okay, so we want to make the earmuff potion. One eye frog in a roaster, wetland grass in an extractor, and squeeze the juice. Blue moon butterfly extract. Okay, I don't think we have all of that. I don't know what that frog thing is. Let's go look in the inventory real quick and check. Let's put stuff away. Oh, let's. Oh, no, let's not move that. Let's learn that. It's fine. We'll hold on to the chalk because I think we can unlock some places. Okay. Let's learn this recipe too. Yellow star juice. Okay, so we were checking for... This is wetland grass. We have the butterfly. I... We need to find the frog next, I think. Yellow star juice. Weed terminator. Earmuff potion. Yeah, one eye frog in a roaster. Wetland grass, blue moon butterfly. Okay, where do we get a one eye frog? I'm gonna go back to the water area. Oh, at night? You could be right. Okay, let's head over that way. Bye, Diane. <gasps> ra, ra Rubrum. I didn't forget your name. So apparently, I, this game is still in early access, I think? And Rubrum is bugged. Apparently he teleports and pops up everywhere. 
The daytime had lizards. I think there was something else at night. Okay. Let's head over. Oh. Oh, birds. Let's go across here. I think we could have gone a different way. Actually, I think we might have to. Oh, I hear the bird. Oh, yeah, we have to use the chalk from the other side. No! Okay, let's circle around. I think the chalk I have now will do it. You want to be able to play this game? You need a PC! This game is so cute. Um, I think we can go down here. Where did we go in? Was it down here? We go all the way up. Can't remember now. Do you guys hear the game sounds? My desktop audio wasn't working last time, so... Okay, we can open this. Yeah, we have two chalk. Might as well use one here. Hopefully Diane will bring some more soon. Okay, here hear lo lots of sounds of music. Is it too loud? Let me know if I need to turn anything down. You know what? Oh, wait, where's my net? Let's see if we can grab this butterfly. Got one. Oh, it's the one-eyed frog. You're so smart. How do I get down here again? Oh, okay, do I net him? Everything's running away. Okay, so obviously we need something. How do we catch the one I frog? He is fast. Oh, you know what we need to do is we need to catalog them first. I think. Right? Can I get close enough to catalog them is the question. And that should give us a hint. Actually, you know what? I think the music is a little loud. Just do the whole thing down to like 30. 25? If you can bait them. That makes sense. Oh no, did they all run away? We have to figure out what they like though. Hmm. Were there some over here? Did I miss all of them? Says there's a sneak button? Oh wait, how... Is there a sneak button? I'm gonna go back up, see if they've respawned. Butterfly. <laughs> I can't reach those from here. Okay, Rococo. I'll be here. Wait, there's a sneak button? <laughs> oh, yeah, there is. Okay, I got it. They might all be gone now, though. Let's get those butterflies. Since they only come out at night. Ah! Oh, 
Alright, um... I'm, I guess if they're gone, they're gone. So maybe we'll try again... Tomorrow night. I would like to use the chalk on the other side of the waterfall. I think I have to circle around though. No, come back here. Or not. I have to go to bed soon anyway. So let's go back to the house. Um, yeah, we just need the frog, I think. my net. Star bell pollen. To bed, to bed. Oh, mm -hmm. no, we didn't go into town today, but I think I already did that quest. Sleepy time. So apparently this is a Korean game originally. So that explains some of the translations, I think. And like the humor in it. Oh, uh, hello, Diane. Let's see if you restocked your shop. Nope. Interesting. Okay, so we have to use that chalk sparingly. Let's see what your quest is today. Two curse lifting candy. 36 coins, that's decent. Let's just do that now before I forget and run out of time. Two curse lifting candies. Hey Coco Coconut, how you doing? Candies, squishy chub fur. And maple herb. Squishy. Hello, chub fur. Don't think I have any made, so we'll take that. And maple. Thought I had more maple. Guess I used it? Huh. Oops. Let's make that. And we'll throw in the maple. Pretty sure it said stage three don't stir. Yeah. Oh wait, we need two of those. Crap, that means I need more maple. I thought I had gathered more. Whoops. Okay, well, we'll make this and we'll go gather more maple. And we'll see what the quest in town is. Okay, put this away. Oh wait, I needed to hold on to that, but we'll come back here anyway. So, let's go foraging. This game is Little Witch in the Woods. I guess I could change my title, huh? Let me do that real quick. Can I do that? I can, right? Oh yeah, here we go. Little Witch in the Woods. Let's play. I'm so bad at coming up with titles. Let's play Little Witch in the Woods. There we go. That should update the title. Oh wait, I tabbed out of the game. There we go. To town we go! No, my thumbnail doesn't match, but oh well. Hey Bun Buns. Let's go to the merchant. 
Let's see what they want today. Good morning, Aria. Do you need anything? Let's see. You want one cough candy. I can do that. Um, let's look in your shop. Branch, piece of rock, mud, books. I don't know what these books are for. We'll see if we need them at some point. point at some point. Or if they're collectibles. Oh, I'm also supposed to talk to this guy about the Gaga bird, but I, th I think we know we need the earmuff potion. What's going on, Gaga bird? It's best to avoid that crazy bird. I really need to get through. Hmm. Then have some beef stew in the meantime while I think. Wow, that looks delicious. 30 gold coins. <laughs> you said you have to go through Gaga bird, don't, didn't you? 30 gold coins? I don't think I have. Do I? He's just gonna tell me to use the earmuff potion. Do I have to talk to him? Ugh, let's eat it. Beef stew made by Arden. I'm not sure what exactly is in it, but it tastes really good. It's difficult unless you can't hear it all. Well, you are a witch after all. I thought you would have come up with something before asking me. That's it? Wait, is there such a potion? Uh, we know what that potion is. Rude. Did that use all my money? Let's head out. Do some foraging, we need maple. And we'll collect anything else we can get. There's Rubrum. We have plenty of apples. Ugh. This one is my least favorite because you have to chase them around. Oops. Come back here! Got him. Pumpkin terrier fur. Okay. That's fine, but we need maple! Let's go. Um, 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 um. They're usually on the vines. Okay, let's not take any more apples. Inventory is full of them. We'll grab this, because why not? Haven't really used the mango yet, but we'll collect some. The dangle mango. Is there maple over here? Oh yeah, we can't forget about the frogs tonight. We sneak up on them. That's a good... I wonder what this flower's gonna be for. It's a good chunk. I need to fix this. I don't know when Diane restocks her shop, so I don't want to use my chalk on this. I'd rather use it to open up a path over on the left side. I'm just gonna hold on to it for now. Oh, my inventory's full. It is. I guess I can put this chalk away. Maybe I can use it. Um, I don't think I can do it from this side. Let me take a quick peek. Yeah, it's on the other side. Let's circle around. Hopefully it's okay to use it. The game seems to provide what you need. So if I need to unlock another area, hopefully I'll have access to chalk. Can I go through here? Cannot. How about here? Let's just open this up. Yes! Woohoo! Let's see if this is where I thought it leads. 
Yeah. Okay, cool. I don't know if we're gonna need to go to that waterfall, but we have access to it now. Okay, 1.30 p.m. Let's go get these potions made. So we can sell them and get some money. Always need money. Hold on, Diane. I'm gonna bring you your potion in a second. Okay. Maple? Oh, wait. My inventory's gonna be full. So, let's do... Oh, wait. It's not full. <gasps> Did I drop the chalk somewhere? Oh, no. I hope it's still there. I didn't realize I dropped it. Whoops. Oh, I want that beef stew. Uh, from what it felt like to me, it's not really possible to hard lock your playthrough by using up your chalk at the wrong place. Okay, good. Well, I just dropped my other piece. No, I used my piece of chalk. Oh my goodness, my brain! <laughs> I used it to unlock the forest place. Oh my goodness, I need to go back to bed. Oh, I don't have the squishy chub fur. I am tired. I can feel the sleepiness. I did wake up early this morning. I was too excited about stream. Very silly, Abby. No, wait, no, we need to make the cough candy too. Might as well do that while we're here. What do I need? Cough candy, pumpkin terrier fur, to smile bubble. Pumpkin terrier fur. Do we have enough of that? We have ten. S um, tears of the moon, smile bubble. Let's put this in here. Pumpkin terrier fur. And did it say smile bubble in the extractor? Smile bubble extract. How much longer do you have? Two, one, done. Okay, then stage two, stir to the right. Stage two, to the right. I messed it up! Wait, was that not to the right? <gasps> I put the wrong thing in. Okay, but I still have it. What did I do? I am tired. <laughs> we'll try to do the earmuff potion and then <laughs> maybe we'll call it a day. But, um, I just wanted to work on the story a bit. <laughs> Oh, here. Here's your potion. Well, that's what happens when you mess up a potion. I did want to know, so... Not yet, not yet. I'm still playing, I'm still playing. I'm just saying that. I'm making mistakes because I'm tired. Delivery complete. Okay, no questions. Goodbye. Welcome back. Have you all had your dinner? I had a cup udon before I started stream. It was yummy. It had some mochi in it. I like chikara udon. Let's go deliver this cough candy. Maybe we can get some more smile bubbles. Um, oops, hit the wrong button. I switched between my um, S Nintendo Switch and my PlayStation controller and the buttons, the AB buttons I guess, or X and O, they're always backwards. Oh, I didn't mean to talk to her again. Ooh, grabbed a sub after the zoo, that sounds good. I really want to make kimba, kim kimba, Korean. I guess sushi rolls? They're so good. 
Because I'm not a huge seafood eater. So they're, they taste better to me than Japanese sushi. Though I suppose, especially in America, you can get sushi rolls that don't have seafood. But I'm also not a big avocado person either. I'm out to go get the big flat rice noodles for my hot pot. Ooh, that sounds good. I want pad thai. I found a decent place near me, but nothing as good as I had in Singapore. I'm sad I didn't try more of like the local cuisine when I visited Thailand, but I was also 15 at the time and a very picky eater, so what can I say? Okay, let's go over to the waterfall area. <laughs> I said the same thing about avocado when I said I didn't like it. I said I'm I'm a bad millennial. Ooh, that does sound like nice weather. It's so cold here. At least it's been sunny. I did not watch Martina's video. I haven't I haven't caught up lately. I did s subscribe to her new channel. <gasps> give me your bubbles. I give you belly rubs. Ugh, these are so cute. I love the blue lizards. <laughs> Thank you for the bubbles. Oh yeah, this is the other grass, wetland grass. Oh, there's a froggy, okay. So we sneak and use net. One eye frog. Can I not add him to my catalog? I wanna do the sketchy sketchy thing. I guess not. I'll just catch him. Get you two butterflies. No! It's too fast. Gotta sneak next time. Do they come back? Is it just three a night? Hmm, let's see if there are any other places we can find them. I did find out how to catch froggy. There's a sneak button, so we sneak up on them and then um, grab them. Squishy chub, boom, boom butterfly, pom pom, one eye frog. Oh, I already had the one eye frog in my book. Uh, they're very cautious, so approach them without without care. Oh, so approaching them without care will leave you only with awe at the strength of their hind legs. There's a pom pom and tinkle spider. Okay. Well, let's let's head back and see if we can make this earmuff potion. Oh, my inventory's full. Whoopsie. Oh, did I find the one I flog? Flog? Frog? You guys remember everything I need to know. Chat, chat is my brain. Oh, that's Sammy barking. Let's. 810. I think we have time to make the potion. I don't know if we'll have time to get back to the Gaga bird. Oh, recorded the frogs and went back. That makes sense. I should have just checked the critter, critterpedia, whatever it's called. I also didn't expect the lizards to be so big. Okay, down we go. Vine core, okay. <coughs> Ski, use me. If 
Firecracker potion. And my potion. Okay. One eye frog in the one eye frog roast. Okay. And then we put in the wetland grass. <laughs> They're adorable. And blue moon butterfly. I need to empty my inventory. We'll put these guys back too. Should I just eat that beef stew? Um. So, okay. Oh, I have a lot of starbell pollen. That is taking up a lot of space. Is the frog done? Completed. Okay. Stage one, ladle left. Stage one, ladle left. Wahoo! Earplug potion. 9.30. I still have time to go, right? Right? Let's see, where is it? Oh, nope, I hear it. I was gonna say, I can't hear it. Maybe it's- Oh, there's a frog. We might as well grab you while we're here. Oh, nope. Never mind. Let's grab you, too. Well, good to know that there are more. Am I not sneaking? Got him. Hi Isabella! I am having fun! You missed the D-stash! I... I did so good? <laughs> you should be proud of me! Um, I got... I went through my Pop Mart and my Tokidoki and I have a huge box to D-stash now. Okay. Let's... I, yeah, I know. It's too noisy. Let's take the potion. Grab. Acquire. That's not what I wanted. Oh, can I not use? Can I not take a potion? Use when you need to concentrate and avoid loud noises. What? <laughs> Super proud. I'll watch it back later to see how you did. Yay! Thanks, Mom! Um, okay, so can I not take this potion? Or is it because it's at night? What's going on? Hmm. Um, I am either going to sell or trade them. Um, on Discord, I'm gonna- I think I'm gonna make a trading channel and see if anyone's interested. If not, I'll- either take them I just I, it's, they're not popular items here in Japan so I don't know if taking them to the thrift store like the figure store would if they'd be worth anything do you have to get a lot closer to the bird to use the potion maybe I'm gonna try again when it's daytime <laughs> Rococo wants the Rococo unicorn yes I just need to look into um like shipping and stuff because I don't there's some countries that I have to send EMS to and like paying twenty dollars for one figure isn't really fun, so we'll see what the options are. Uh, I'm gonna put these frogs away actually. But yeah, if I can send airmail I wish um S S A L Sal surface and land was still a thing, but since 
2020, it's kind of been not really available for a lot of countries. I need to see. But yes, it would be fun to trade. Okay. Let's go back to the bird. Maybe I will try getting closer. Did you have a good day, Isabella? Having a fun weekend? You could send a figure or something and maybe a stationary card you make. Ooh! That would be fun. Yeah, I, I would like to do that. I want to make stickers. There's a sticker I want to print. It's too noisy. Take the potion. Grab. No. I can put it down on the ground. Yeah, I get this dialogue when I get any closer. Hmm. It's best to be cautious of accidents due to restrictive effects on your hearing. Is there a way to avoid the horrible gaga bird? Find the prickly core. Fine. Fine core. Why? Oh, I need, I need to give lizards tummy rub. They are asking for it. Or maybe not. I cannot interact. Oh, it's because I don't have my hand. Tool. Nope, roll over. Okay, so we need to figure out how to take this potion. Oh, the item says earplug. Did I take the wrong thing? Wetland grass, stage one, left, pour in vessel. I mean, I think it's the same thing, right? Did I make something wrong? It has the effect of keeping the drinker from perceiving noises. Be careful, it may affect your ability to communicate if you don't focus carefully on the noise. Oh, when drinking it, wait. If you don't focus carefully. What does that mean? When you hold the potion, it shows a drink button. I... Was I just pressing the wrong button? Hold on. Okay, I will grab. And then... It, the A or whatever button just puts it back in my inventory. And this one drops it on the ground. Hmm. Oh, drink. You're right. I see it now. Thank you. There we go. I was pushing the wrong button. Thank you, Adam. Go away. I guess I should read the text, huh? <laughs> Having a good weekend so far. I went to Daiso earlier and bought stationary stuff. Daiso also has me splurging on everything. It's so easy to, like add things to your cart at Daiso. It's like, it's just it's just a few dollars. It's just a dollar. I missed the train because of that bird. Let's hurry and find the prickly vine core. First time in here. I think I saw a spider up there, so we'll get ready to investigate it. Ooh, I think this is a new flower. Oh, no, can't pick that. Following the vines. Oh, it's circling around. Hmm. I don't read anything in games. Yeah, it's a bad habit of mine. I get yelled at a lot by my friends. Because I'm always asking questions because I don't pay attention. <laughs> Is this where we came in? Yeah, that's where we came in. But that's what my friends are there for. To tell me what to do. 
They do look like flowers you can pick. Is this? Oh, draw with quill. Hello, new plant. Little mandrake. Aww. Do I need a shovel? Oh no, I can just pull them out of the ground. <laughs> Aww. Oh. Oh. Oh, I probably need the earplug potion for them too, huh? Let's look. It must be pulled with care as to not harm its roots. It screams when it feels threatened, though not as deadly as an adult. It still puts a strain in the body if heard continuously. Okay, so I probably need a potion for that too. Look at I have like confusion. Oh, okay, I need the weed terminator potion. Find the core. I see the core. Okay. And there's some chalk down there too. Got it. Harry Potter taught us they scream. They do. Well, now you have me to be the worst player. We're, we're on par. <laughs> My roommates, the guys I grew up with, have just come to accept I don't read and tell me what I need to know. Same. It's fine, my friends. Oh, look at those birds up there in the tree! Nope, I think I need a nap for this. My friends know me. They know they know what they can expect and what they can't expect from me. Let's read about the spider before we try to catch it. Take care when approaching them. Okay. I will sneak. Got one. Why is it? It's called the tinkle spider because it makes the bell sound. I want those birds that are up in the tree. Okay, so I think that is the part of the root vine root thingy that we need to get rid of. So let's go try to make some weed potions. Weed terminating potions. <laughs> weed potions sound like something else. Oh, I should have saved the little chalk? No, I don't need it. I guess there are unfinished ones and ones that I can just do the spell on. Weed potions sound delicious. <laughs> Don't be a Neville, ne long bottom. Okay, let me see if I remember. Oh, I'm s I still have confusion. Hope I don't need to take something for that. We terminated potion, squishy chub fur, and witch flower. We can do that. Oh, I am out of room. Okay. Squishy chub fur and witch flower. In you go. Confusion will go away after I sleep. I hope so. I don't know what it's actually doing to me either. I don't seem to be walking faster or slower. I think maybe if I keep doing it, it makes me sick, maybe? The way it said it can do more damage after a while or something. Uh, stage four, don't stir. Stage four, don't stir. I think I just need one of these. Oh wait, I didn't do my quests today. Ugh, it's fine. We are on a mission. I was so... I also forget to use my broom. <laughs> I feel like I can't talk either. After we finish this quest line, I am going to go take a nap. So, you guys may have seen, I posted on Discord a few times, but I am currently obsessed with this game called Sky. It's a free, I guess technically a mobile game, but I got it on Switch, and you're just this little sky kid that flies around and collects wings, and basically saves the world. But it's just a weekly looping 
quest line, but I'm obsessed with it because you can get really cute cosmetics. Wait, I can't remove. Grab. Throw while aiming. There we go. Let me through, let me through. Remove. You're playing now? What? Okay, now what? Oh, no, 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 don't pull him up. He's going to scream again. Follow the prickly vines again. Isn't this what I needed? Are there more? I guess we keep looking. Not as horrible cosmetics. I know. It's a super grindy game, though. It was way more grindy than I expected. Follow the vines again. I think I followed him into here though, didn't I? Because I can't go out here. There must be another one I need to break down or something. Hmm. I swear this flower looks like I should be able to pick it. I'll have to show you guys my sky character. Maybe maybe in a few weeks after I have more cute things on it. Um Yeah, I'm not sure where I'm supposed to follow the vines to now. Maybe up? They're everywhere. Because this is where I came from. There must be another patch somewhere. I should have made more potions. Is there anywhere to go up here? Nope. I think I go this way, maybe. Whoa! Hello? Where does this connect to? Just over here. Okay, interesting. Hello? Who lives here? I guess this isn't something we need to know about right now. Hmm. Okay. There's something sparkling. Yeah, I think I need the um, twinkle potion to go in here. Actually, maybe that's what we'll do next then. Let's go home. I need a teleport button. The vines do lead up here, so... Abby's doppelganger lives there. Oh wait, this isn't the right way. Hello! How you doing? Probably should be picking up all these stones too. Yeah, I haven't really been playing many games on mobile. I really got into Cats and Soup while I was in the States and I was quarantining because I got sick. Um, but other than that, I don't... I used to play Tsum Tsum, like hardcore, but now everything is on Switch and PC. Sky is adorable. If you like Genshin and you're okay with that kind of grindy, it's like a simplified Genshin, I feel like. Happy Sunday! Wawan, am I saying that right? Storage is full! 
Cats and Soup wasn't for you. Yeah. Merging game with Sound Puzzle games are so fun. Uh, yellow star juice. It's originally supposed to brighten one's surroundings in a dark work environment, but it's rarely used as its glow isn't bright enough. So it looks like these twinkle juices are all the same. But it's rarely used. But I think... I think maybe this is what we use. We need that spider. Go put him in the roaster. Just roast that spider. Ugh. Fake tinkle spider. How long is this gonna take? 17 seconds. We need smile bubble. Oh, bush bug. Oh, I don't think we have any of... Oh no, we do! We have a bunch! I don't even remember where I got them. That was smile bubble, right? Successfully got rice noodles and some sweets. Ooh. St <coughs> Excuse me. Stage two to the right. <coughs> Stage two to the right. Wahoo! Yellow star juice. Okay, it's 10.20. I think I go to bed and try in the morning because I don't want to get sent back home while I'm out. Hopefully days don't matter on here. Is that a cat? Okay, okay. I sip some water. I lied. I sip my juice box. <laughs> Had a strange dream. <clears throat> I don't remember saved. Okay, let's go back to that cave. When do you refresh your shop? Hmm. Okay. Wait, there was an upgrade button. Was that for my inventory? A work tool. You can improve tools. Bigger quantities of ingredients or potions. Okay. Interesting. Oh, bigger. That's good. That'll be good for like money making and stuff. So I don't have to do it one at a time. Bye. Actually, let's go into town real quick and see if I can expand my inventory. Because I assume that's the merchant that I'd talk to. This game is cute. It is on PC. I'm not sure if it's on Switch yet. It's still in early access. So it's probably not on a lot of things. Shop. Expand back. Here we go. Let's see how expensive this is. Wait, how much money do I have? Where do I see how much money I have? Eh. Expand bag. 180 gold coins. Yes. I guess I had 180 gold coins. Where do I see my- oh, there we go. I have 585. You know what? I'm just gonna expand it again if she'll let me. Four hundred! Ugh, let's do it. Why not? I wonder when I can expand my inventory at home. Is that part of upgrading tools, do you think? I love this game. I can't wait until they update it some more because I heard that you do kind of run out of things to do. So far I'm still doing the story quest. Oh, my, my broom is running out of power. I need to collect branches for it. But, yeah, I, no, don't use your potion. I hope this is a game that they keep updating and... I can keep coming back to it. Sorry, I got distracted. Why does it keep wanting me to take my potion? I guess that must be the button. Oh, because it's in the bottom right there. I see it. <laughs> Imagine tools if I can update my home. Yeah, I agree. We'll come We'll come back and talk to Diane in a second. I need to go see this cave.
I want my broom. I think I can go from here. Um, let's cut through here. I think it was up by the waterfall, wasn't it? Or am I confused? I might be confused. I am confused. Let's go back down. No, thank you, Rococo. It is super chill. I, I won't lie, it is making me a little bit sleepy. But this is totally a game that I would play before bed. Like, all the gathering and stuff. So you can put on a... I'm... <laughs> I like to do multiple things at once, so I would totally put on a show and play this. Sorry, birdies. I think I came the long way around. I'm still learning the maps here, but... Oh, it's daytime. Let's see if anyone's here. Nope. There's no, like, dialogue or anything either. Interesting. Okay, let's go into this cave. Let's try this potion. See if it makes me glow. <gasps> it does! And I don't need chalk. Nice. Oh, that's why I couldn't get through. And I couldn't see. Oh. What is this? Do I need to come here at a certain time of day, maybe? I bet that's who lives in that tent. Ah! Okay, we'll come, we'll come back again. Oh, and there's some chalk up here, too. Nice. No, oh, thank you, Adam! You're so sweet! Yeah, this game, I don't think it was very expensive either. It's like a cute little indie game, I think. There's so many that I want to play. There's so many farming sims that I want to check out. But I have a bunch of like little single player games that I've purchased on Steam when they're on sale and stuff. So I hope we can have many, many chill gaming weekends or nights. Okay, well... That didn't help me with the vines. Hmm. Let's keep following them maybe up? I'm forbidden from buying not food or gas items until next pay period. Uh, I'm, I kind of agree with that. I should do the same for myself. I was trying not to um, buy any takeout or like eat out. Because I have a big trip in February, but I I have eaten out and ordered food many times this month. <laughs> okay, I'm not sure where I'm following these vines now. Because we got rid of that one, but obviously there are more somewhere. Let's grab these stones at least. I think you need to finish the games you started before I'm playing new ones. What ones do I need to finish? Like, Minecraft is a continuous game. Splatoon's a continuous game. Animal Crossing, there's always a new home. But I do, I do want to work on my Animal Crossing Island. I think that would be a chill stream game as well. Whoops, I was reading chat and I got stuck. I'm... I'm I'm just gonna be in Japan. It's gonna be a not not a, not a staycation, but um, my friend's visiting from the states, so we're gonna be traveling around Japan. I'm going to a few new places. I'm excited. It'll be fun, but it is a bit of a longer trip. So leading up to it, I'm stressing a little bit. Got to do my taxes and stuff, but it's gonna be fun.
Animal Crossing gives me anxiety because my villagers are really mean when I get back. Ah, No! Um, I'm... I'm stuck. Can... Does this vine quest not have a continuation? I need to look into it because I did see on the reviews that the game isn't complete. So hopefully I'm not just wandering around for no reason. Thank you, Rococo. I, I hope I have fun too. I think I will. It's just I overthink things and I am stressing a bit about being a guide. A good guide, I guess. And going to new places, but... It will be fine. Oh, you still you play New Leaf. I was going to say they're not mean in um uh New Horizons. But yes, New Leaf, they can be very mean. Also they leave while you're gone. That always makes me sad. I actually wouldn't mind playing New Leaf again. I should I should go find my 3DS. I'm the perfect guide. Thank you. Nah, I just like I just like stressing about things that don't need stressing about. <laughs> Okay, yeah, I don't know where these vines lead, but um, here is some chalk that I need to use a potion to get. Oh yeah, the old, old um, Animal Crossing games, they were super mean. Also, we don't have uh, Mr. Rossetti yelling at us every time we close the game. Oh, we probably should collect birds. Yeah, I don't know where these vines are leading. I am going to head back. And... 520, what else can I do? Because I think I've been everywhere I can go. Do we come back here at night to see what the bear does? There's like no clues. It's... Oh, there's something up there, too. Can I get up there? I don't think I can. I said he was the meanest. He yells! Yeah, I don't know what this is. It must be like a certain time of day or something. Do I bring something? Oh, now it's nighttime. 6 p.m. It says follow the prickly vines again. I don't know where to follow them to. They are everywhere. Hmm. Let's climb up here. Oh, I can use this chalk now, but does this connect? I think that's just for convenience. Let's grab this maple while we're at it. Hello? There we go. Are these just for butterflies? Oh no. Ah! Scatter. Hey, Cassie! Okay. If it's something I can figure out, I would like to figure it out, but if it's something that's just like incomplete, that is kind of a waste of time. <laughs> Agnes! Why does Agnes sound familiar? I'm gonna go down to the train track, see if that area has anything. So vines do... Oh, they lead that way. Hmm. 
Bob's a cutie. I don't think there is anything I can do down here. There are no vines here either. Maybe I go back into town and look around? Hmm. Chow is a cranky villager, so he would be mean, huh? Where am I? Actually, is there anything to the right of the village? We didn't really look, but... Hmm... Nothing but ruins... Yeah, I don't think we can go this way. Oh, maybe? Is there anything down here? Hmm, doesn't seem like it. Well, we're just taking a nice little stroll. Oh, that's Sammy trying to get out. Oh wait, there is something back here. What is this? Let's pull these weeds. Temple of the Cat God. The sign is broken. Maybe the god is angry. The cat god is probably always angry. Here, I'll weed. I'll weed the front of your temple, cat god. <laughs> You're still alive? That is rude. In New Horizons, they're like, where have you been? I visited your house and you weren't there. I missed you. It's like all sad. New Leaf in previous games. <laughs> You're back? You don't have enough stamina. Okay. Can I eat some? Let's eat this stew. Eat. Though it is almost bedtime. No, I don't want to open the dialogue. I just want to weed. Those all the weeds I can... No! Stop it! Skip dialogue. <laughs> nope. Don't have enough stamina. There, cat god. I weeded... I weeded your sign. Hope you're happy now. Hey, Justin! What's in here? Nothing. Hey, what you doing? Welcome. Do you have something to say? Wait, you have a shop? Oh, okay. Yeah, someone was saying that Rubrum's tea shop isn't available yet, either. So, there's gonna be more added to the game, definitely. Okay, let's head back to the house. Such a stark difference, it really is. Well, since I'm out of stamina, I guess we go to bed and... I, I don't know what to say. I feel like I've been everywhere, but I'm probably missing something. But if this is as far as the early access goes, I feel like I should look that up. Abby <laughs> shout out This is Little Witch in the Woods And we are trying to find the root The vine Like it's taking over the town And people are leaving because of it So we're trying to get rid of it So we can restore the village To its former glory But I'm having trouble finding 
the vine. We got rid of one part of it. Uh, okay, I'm gonna go to bed. We're gonna talk to Diane in the morning, see if we can expand that to storage. Because that's annoying me. And then... We may call it a day, because it do be feeling a lot like nap time. And then I have a video to edit for tomorrow. I'm gonna have a random Pop Mart blind box unboxing. Um, perfect timing. We just, um... Ah, my brain. Destashed all of my Pop Marts. Not all of, but some of. And, um, I'll edit this stream. I'll edit down the destash part into, like, a VOD. Make it a little more easy to watch. Shop. Upgrade. Oh no, I can upgrade storage. Interesting, okay. I wonder where I do that. Also, when do you restock your catalog? Snacks, water, and nap. Yes, I agree. Oh, there's something here. Can is this can I grab that? Nope, it's just sitting there. Take a nap. Look at perfect. That's me. In like ten minutes. Let me weed my yard. Yeah, I am kind of wondering if there's nothing else I can do to find the prickly vine core. Hmm. Okay. Well, I think I will call it here because I am just baffled. I think I need to look up a guide or something. So we'll come back to this next time. D-Stash was great. I think we accomplished a lot. Um, maybe next time we'll go through a different container. But for now I am going to go get a snack and pass out. Thank you all for hanging out with me. I, I said it earlier but I could not have made all those decisions without you guys. I would have been overwhelmed. It was great chatting with you all and having you all helping me. And I hope you all have a great weekend. I guess a lot of you still have Sunday to enjoy. And I will talk to you Monday at my Pop Mart premiere. Bye!